Hi friends, well, welcome back to my kitchen. My name is Yvonne. Today I'll be sharing with you one of my favorite all-time soft milk bread recipe. Very easy to go about it. Few ingredients, but very tasty. So don't turn off your phone. Keep watching. And don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. For that makes me happy. So guys, in this recipe, I'll be very detailed and you're going to discover the ingredients as we cook along. In the first step, what you need to do is warm a cup of milk, just warm it like lukewarm. Add in a tablespoon of sugar and two teaspoons of active dry yeast. Mix these three ingredients together, then set aside for like 10 minutes to bloom until foamy. In the next step, you will need three cups of all-purpose flour, one quarter cup of sugar, one tablespoon of salt, and then you're going to mix all the dry ingredients together. And you take note, guys, if you want more bread, you can just double the ingredients and make sure you see if you flour before using I'm using all-purpose flour. In the next step, crack in one egg, one third cup melted butter, and, and then you add in the yeast mixture. Then you mix. I mean the yeast mixture, the yeast milk mixture. Add it in gradually and you mix. Next, when you form the dough, sprinkle a little bit of flour on the chopping board or the flat surface where you want to knead it. Take out the dough and then you knead well for like 10 minutes until it is soft and elastic. When you don't need the dough for 10 minutes, this is what you do guys. Just form a round ball and then using your bowl, you pour in a little bit of cooking oil, you grease the bowl and then you put in the dough, cover it with a transparent cling wrap or a kitchen cloth and allow the dough to rest for one hour until it doubles in size. And this is how the group looks like one hour later. So what you're going to do is just punch the dough a little bit so that the gas can escape. When you punch it, you release the gas that is inside the dough.
you can now move to the next step. In this step, what you do is take out the dough, put it on the chopping board, you can divide it in half, and then you form your loaves and put in a baking pan. But before you do that, this is what you do guys. Flatten the dough using the rolling pin, then you can cut it into your desired shapes to form the loaves before putting in the baking pan. Next, grease your baking pan using some cooking oil and you can line the corner of the baking pan using a parchment paper if you have it, but if you don't have it, that's fine. We are not yet done guys, when you form the loaves, cover it and set it aside for another 30 minutes. notice that the dough has increased again in size what you do is mix one egg and a teaspoon of milk then you use it to gently brush over the dough after you do that you can now go ahead and bake it in the oven at a temperature of 180 degrees for 20 minutes Milk bread is ready, guys. Go ahead and enjoy. Now that you know how to make your milk bread, why not go ahead and make some milk bread for breakfast, for a friend, for a neighbor, and make them happy? Please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to my YouTube channel so that you can always be the first to watch my videos each time I upload them.
job, same town, cause we've been told 